Okay, I want to show you a trick about static stretching. Notice I'm kind of leaning on a couple of things here while I'm statically. So I'm trying to stretch my psoas, which is a group of muscles that kind of attach from your femur bone up onto your spine. And they're tough to get at. And one of the mistakes that a lot of people make while static stretching, and remember, static stretching is the type of stretching we all know, right? That's the one where we reach and hold, you know what I mean? Um, versus dynamic flexibility, which is what we use in GPP, versus ballistic, which is the bouncing kind of flexibility. Static flexibility sort of tries to pull the muscles apart, but in order to do that, it can't be flexing the muscle while it's doing it. And so one of the mistakes that a lot of people make, especially right here in this hip flexor stretch, right? And this, while people are trying to stretch their psoas, this set of muscles deep in there, um, is they hold themselves up, flexing the muscle while they're trying to stretch it. So we have a problem there, right? If you're trying to stretch a muscle that's flexed, go ahead and try it. I'm gonna stretch my biceps. I'm not gonna increase my flexibility. And any increase in flexibility you get is generally gonna be like a tendon or a ligament or one of the things that you don't wanna stretch. In order to statically stretch a muscle, it's got to be relaxed. So here's one of my tricks, especially for this one, is when I try to stretch that psoas, I hold on to a couple of things. Sometimes I'll use chairs, and today I'm just using this stuff. I'll support my body weight with my hands, and I'll let some of that body weight go down in and stretch that muscle. And for me, this is a lot of flexibility for me. I have struggled with my flexibility for years and I'm doing new stuff now, but um, I'm starting to see a little gain and I think that you will too if you'll remember that during static flexibility, when you're stretching a muscle sort of passively in a static fashion, you can't be flexing that muscle and hope to gain any sort of increased range of motion out of it.